some smoke across our region and we'll also have these really hot temperatures. Now tonight set by 7 p.m. we'll have 85 degrees, 78 by 9 p.m. and 74 by 11 p.m. And this is what it looks like outside right now. Temperatures in the 80s and 90s here for the Front Range and for the Eastern Plains. 60s and 70s for the most part up in the high country, but it'll be another warm day tomorrow with those highs in the 90s for the afternoon. So we're expecting hot weather to continue over the next few days. 84 degrees right now in Denver, 90 at DIA, low 80s toward Highlands Ranch and Centennial, and then we have those 70s out toward Golden and up toward Dumont. Now we've seen, or we're going to, over the next 24 to 48 hours, some improvement here with the smoke across the Front Range in the Eastern Plains. You'll see that this is yellow, perhaps a little green mixed in there. The main plume of smoke coming from Canada and the Pacific Northwest is pushing down into the central United States. Now we'll probably still see some waves of smoke, but we're at least seeing a little bit of improvement. Wildfire smoke and ozone alert though, here for the Front Range, air quality will be poor here into tomorrow. Same for wildfire smoke up towards Steamboat. So we're keeping an eye on all of this going into the next few days, but it does look like we'll have unhealthy situations for breathing out for the weekend. As we go into our satellite radar picture, a few scattered showers off to our west and across the eastern plains, some lightning out toward Byers and then Pueblo to Colorado Springs along I-25, some showers out that direction as well. We also have a severe thunderstorm watch in effect until 11 p.m. here for extreme northeastern Colorado, just north of Burlington, one storm cell just about to leave the state, but there is a lot of lightning with that, so we're keeping an eye on it. Our temperatures will be in the 80s through 9 p.m. tonight, then into the 70s for much of the rest of the evening. Our future cast looks pretty quiet tonight. We've really just seen a few thunderstorms pop up and those will be leaving us in through the rest of the evening. So not a lot of moisture here for the front range. We'll have partly cloudy skies tonight. Our low around 60 degrees and we'll have those temperatures in the 50s and 60s for eastern Colorado as we go into tomorrow morning, mostly 40s and 50s up into the higher elevations off to our west. So if you're headed out early to walk the dog or just get in a walk yourself, temperatures will be in the 60s and 70s through the early morning and then up to 90 degrees by one o'clock so you might want to mow the lawn earlier in the day because we will be in the 70s then we really heat it up later in the afternoon and if you're mowing out later it could increase those ozone levels temperatures in the low 90s for tomorrow afternoon scattered thunderstorms late in the day we'll have those low 90s here from denver to sterling to ray down into southwestern colorado temperatures around pagosa springs and durango in the 80s and on our super seven day forecast we are going to be in the low 90s over the weekend we'll also have 90s into the beginning beginning of next week. It still looks great for some grilling on Sunday. 93 the high at noon will be sunny and hazy, a temperature of 86 degrees and then up to 93 by 5 o'clock and going into the beginning of next week, those 90s, but we drop to 88 on Wednesday with a few scattered thunderstorms.